not a good start to the March Madness tournament for the algorithm. Bad times, lots of losses. Everything I mentioned yesterday lost. Virginia, Utah State, Texas A&M, Boise State is the underdog, West Virginia, Iowa. Oh my goodness. Yeah, awful day. Brackets destroyed before even a late lunch is over. I mean, wow. Awful day. We only got a few of these right. You can see anything in green is something that the AI bracket got correct. Uh, everything else, I mean, these games were even closer. Houston game was kind of close. You got the big upset of uh, Princeton beating Arizona. That's going to be a tough one. Not many people had. Kansas wins, Arkansas wins, and UCLA wins. But, man, that was a brutal start. Um, yeah, brackets just destroyed. Uh, terrible West Virginia list. It's just awful, awful, awful. But that's what happens sometimes. So rough day for the algorithm. Let's see. Friday. Let's take a look. Let's go over it and take a look at exactly what we have here on Friday. We've got a bunch of different games. We have them all in here. Ah, I'm trying to move something. There we go. So let's hide this right here and take a look at everything and see if anything is you know, differing from what the odds makers said. Odds makers beat the algorithm on Thursday. That's for darn sure. Here you've got rough lines up top here. Um, St. Mary's over VCU. TCU over Arizona State injured. Iowa State over Pittsburgh. It says Indiana. Both these teams have some injuries. Indiana and Kent State. Creighton, Miami, Florida. Kentucky is injured against Providence. That could be an upset there. Just I don't know. Just don't listen to anything that comes out of my mouth, honestly. Like, everything's bad. Bad strength of schedules down here for these teams. Uh, Florida Atlantic and USC. Uh, so that's kind of probably why they're at the bottom of the list and they're underdog lines. But that is the look for Friday. Um, will it get better? It can't get too much worse. I mean, there's too many up upsets here. So we'll see. Only nine picks correct out of the first 16 games. That is not, not good enough. It's not 14%. It's actually more than that because we're only looking at the round one game. So it was nine out of 16. So We'll take a look and see what happens on Friday. Uh, if there's one thing to do, I don't know, make your own picks. <laughs> Anything can happen. It's college basketball. Really rough day on Thursday, but we'll see what happens on Friday. All right. Good luck, everyone. May all your picks be winning.